Welcome to Open Felwyn. And today we're going to do some biggins. Wow, that's a naughty start. So we've parked today, guys, down in the Hart Hope Valley, Langley Ford. We're going to do Hedge Up, Coombe Fell, Bloody Bush Edge, Windy Gale, and Cheviot. Nice big loop, it's about 20 miles. So if you want to download the GPX file, it'll be in the link down below. Right, and we've passed Housey Crags. You'll be able to see Long Crags just behind me, and in front of me there is Hedge Up Hill, and there it is Hedge Hope. The ascent from this side is an absolute nightmare, but the only thing it does have going for it is once you're at the top, you're at the top. There's no false summit from this direction, so yeah. We'll take that as a bonus one more grim. Yeah. Bringing you the panoramic views. As Graham says, probably the best view in the Chivia right here. Gotta be. Proof is wrong. We are very nearly at the top of a hundred foot and we'll be at the cairn and hopefully that's the hardest part of the day done straight away hopefully here we go the top oh there's people up here as well so there's hedge up summit sheviet Two little clips there, Yevron Bell, Humboldt Hill, Cold Law, Langley Crags, Housey Crags, Cheviot Knee. Over to the left of me here, we've got Dunmore Hill, leading down to Cunyon Crags. Beyond Hedge Up, you'll see Coombe Fell, Bloody Bush Edge. In the distance, we'll have Windy Gale. The more you come here, guys, the more your little internal map builds up. Personally, I think it's a, it's a safety, safety feature. Knowing where you are. Whoa. So we've just left Hedge Up Hill. We're going down towards the notorious Coombe Fell and although it's an absolutely stunning day today it was raining yesterday so I'm sure we'll still get wet feet in all the peat bogs over there is our next destination which will be bloody bush edge Right then, we are now in the bit between Hedge Up and Coombe Fell. Can be a bit moist down here, guys, <laughs> in the winter. If you're watching the video, you'll have seen the introduction credits where it flashes up Northern Fell running just out of interest. That is the bit that Lee is filming right now in time lapse, so that's what you see. 
coming off Hedge Up Hill down to the dip between Hedge Up and Coombe Fell. Right guys, this is Coombe Fell. Fairly nondescript, really. Not much of a, um, a peak. So after you leave Coombe Fell, there is a very obvious track follows this fence line. This is going to take us all the way, you can just see it there in front of me, Cold Law Cairn. That's our next destination. Right then, we are approaching Cold Law Cairn. We're fairly sure this is Kidland Forest. In front of me, Windy Giles just popped into view. So we'll be running back along the ridge. Yeah, we are at Cold Law Cairn, and this is Northern Fell running. Well, we're on another hill. Lee, what's it called? This is called Nags Head Knoll. And that's going to lead us to the start of the climb for well, Bloody Bush Edge, which is just over this little raise. Well, everybody, we've returned to one of our most watched clips of Lee disappearing into this peat bog. Oh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, this is what we we'll, this is what we want to see. Oh. Could it happen again? Go on, Lee. Oh, look at that. Ooh. Lee's not playing ball, everybody. You've upset the audience there, Lee. And we are arriving at the top of Bloody Bush Edge. A little bit naughty, wasn't it? It's not warm. Lee's moaning about the warm. I'm loving it. It's not cold. Fantastic. Right guys, we're here at Bloody Bush Edge. And I just thought I'd point out a little bit of uh, local interest. There's a gentleman called Peter Reed comes up here and, and paints the tree points. So look how lovely it is. I believe he's just posted on Facebook, he's just done uh, one up on the way to achieve it so we'll see that one later i'm not sure if he does windy guile but uh, any of peter's paint jobs that we passed today i think i'll point them out because that's class thanks peter <coughs> so we are heading down off bloody bush edge windy guile slightly to the left of us which is next on our list of destinations. After that, it's a pretty straightforward run back to the top of Cheviot. We're currently at about nine miles. Feeling pretty good. Sometimes it's sheep, sometimes it's cows. Lee's now getting attacked by a goose. Oh, yeah, man. Why can you not just leave well alone? Honestly, look, I'm not following you. Go away. Yep. We're now on track. Windy Gale straight in front of Lee there. This is the path you will take on the Windy Gale Fell Race. Not long now. And then we've just got GB at the crack. Right, we're here. Windy Gale. Looks like another Peter Reed paint job. Look at that man. Impressive work down here in Scotland. A cocklow foot down there. The shell. We are in Scotland at the moment. And we're just gonna cross over this fence back into England. Which is just there. Oh, seven miles to achieve it. Yeah, we'll go. Another one from Peter.
I can see a video forming in my mind here. Peter, I'm getting in touch with you. So this is our final climb. This path feels endless, by the way. <sighs> now, we've just ran from Windy Gile. The climb has begun up to Cheviot. Last climb of the day. Whoa. It's a very uh, hard route this guys. I think we're completely underestimated this one. Don't know well has helped. It's boiling hot. We both bought two litres of water and we're both getting quite low. We're not gonna run out, but it is hot. Right then everybody, we are arriving at our final destination, Cheviot Summit, which looks like it's also been freshly painted by the legend, Peter Reed. We're both very glad to get here, aren't we? Lee? That uh, climber from Windy Gile. <sighs> Not sure I enjoyed that. It was a bit of a pig. Ah, but we are here. Oh, a couple of miles now down to the valley and back to the car. Oh. Ouch. What an amazing view of Hedgehog. Hard up valley down below. It feels so nice to be actually going down. I feel like I've just climbed all day. This route was brutal guys, gotta say. Brutal. Very hard. Totally underestimated it. But if you want to give it a go, GPX link down below. I think I'll sign off now. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next video.